Hello and welcome. Today I wanted to do just a quick little video on how to update your RGB 20S by Power Kitty. So you're going to need a couple of things, a little Wi-Fi dongle. I think I spent about a hundred rand on this. It doesn't have the craziest speeds, but it does the job. It's really tiny. In this case, I needed a adapter. So this goes from USB to USB-C. So you can see that there, this is the adapter that's quite large and you're going to need the Wi-Fi dongle. Once you have that in, and I would suggest plugging it in before you power on the device, then you can go up to options. If this is your first time, when you go to options, you can go to Wi-Fi. You can see it there at the bottom. Wi-Fi and A will be your select button and it'll show you various connections which you can join or exit so you'll use the back L1 button to move around there or the R and then A will confirm or X to exit. I'm going to use the A button here on this X because I'm already connected. All right then once you're ready to update what I'm going to suggest is that you plug into a power source before you hit the update or at least have one nearby and then you're going to go to update and it'll make a few sounds and it'll warn you about this it'll ask you to back up which i suggest you do as well and then you can back up via the internet okay it's asking me to type in Okay, just wants to make sure that you're sure that you want to update. And it's going to start running the scripts and make this funny noise. And it's going to do this for a while. It's taken up to 20 minutes for me in the past. So you can just leave it to do its thing until it's done. And that's how you update your RGB 20S. Remember, make a backup before you start your update. Thanks for watching.